Hey everyone, it is Dewey and I am back from Germany. This is MC Direct episode 5. Uh, so if you guys have watched all the other MC Directs, you'll know that this is kind of where you get to figure out what's going on in our lives and uh, our channels. And so we're going to start off real quick with Raymond. He's probably the most active person on our channel right now. And he's been doing uh, quite a lot of San Andreas and Minecraft. Uh, so go over to his channel, check out his San Andreas stuff. It's his favorite game of all time, guys. Uh, and he's played that game more than you want to know. Like, he, he spends more time with that game than breathing, probably. Uh, so go watch that. He knows a lot. He has a lot of really good information, and he's just screaming and, and doing all the Raymond stuff that he does. Uh, like I said, he also has some Minecraft stuff up. Uh, he's still doing Lay, Ray, Lay Plays Minecraft. Well, we do English, not good. Uh, Ray Plays Minecraft. Uh, so yeah, those are, those are entertaining, I guess, if you like that kind of stuff. Oh, I'm just kidding. I love Raymond. Um, you also have Tom. Tom's been doing Skyrim, uh, my old game. I know a lot of you guys want me to continue that game. We'll see if that, uh, if that will happen. I, I kind of want to kind of, I'm not sure yet. Um, but Hey, you know, we'll see what happens. Uh, maybe I'll do that. He also will have some Spelunky up. Uh, he's told me a little birdie named Tom has told me, Tom, it's not really a bird, he's a human being, um, but he's told me that uh, he'll be doing some Spelunky, and then also, a little treat for you guys, me and him will be commentating some League of Legends games, and uh, that kind of bridges over, a bridge of wonderfulness, it bridges over to what I want to be doing, um, the direction that I want to be taking my channel is in a very League of Legends oriented channel. That is like my heart and passion right now is League of Legends. Um, I watch way too many streams for my own good. Like there's really not a moment in time in which I'm not watching a stream. Like in fact, there is a stream up in the background of this computer right now that I am watching. Um, and so I, I really want to kind of focus and do a lot more content on that. Very informative, really awesome content. I've got some really big things planned uh, for the next uh, month, pretty much, for League of Legends. So look forward to that. I hope you guys really enjoy it. Um, and uh, I also ha I have some vlogs currently up on my channel that detailed my trip, what I did there. Um, so if you guys want to see that, go over there, check that out. Um, and then Zach has nothing. I don't know if... I'm not going to swear. I won't do it, but I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> No, uh, Zach, I'm sure, has some kind of plan, or if he doesn't, whatever, he'll come up with one. He's Zach, Zachariah Felling. He'll do what he wants. Um, he is currently in Illinois right now, and so that leads me into what we are doing for Media Cows. Uh, last week, if you guys saw, we have some Orcs Must Die 2 uh, that came up, and uh, it's pretty cool. I really enjoyed the game at PAX East 2012. I know Tom did as well. Go over there and check that out. It's like a kind of defend, uh, tower defense game. Third person mode, a lot of fun, get to really control everything. I know Tom and Raymond are having a good time with it, and they are kind of funny, so go check them out now. They're, they're, they're hilarious, I think, sometimes. Um, <laughs> I'm talking really, really fast, but I'm really enjoying it. Um, what we have coming up for Media Cows is hopefully some Left 4 Dead. I was out of town. I had really bad internet in Germany. It wasn't great, um, so we had some issues in recording Left 4 Dead while I was over there. I'm like, okay, I'm back now. Let's do some. But then Zach left. He hates me. He doesn't want to see me anymore. He's like, Dewey's coming back to the States. Let's leave. Um, but no, he did go down there for some family time, uh, which is awesome. Uh, his family's awesome, I think. I know some of his family, not all of his family. Uh, but yeah, so he should be back Thursday. Um, hopefully we can get some Left 4 Dead done for you guys, because I know you guys really enjoy the series. We like playing it. Um, and yeah, other than that, I don't know what else is going up on Media Cows this week. Uh, you kind of never know. If you guys really, 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 really badly want to see us play a game, a four-player game, hopefully, um, three, two also is acceptable, uh, go and tell us. Tell us on uh, this, this, this video, leave it in the comments, go over to our Facebook, go over to my Facebook, Dewey, um, it's a fan page, search that, like it, and comment on there. I try to respond to just about everyone. Uh... And tell us what you guys want to see, because uh, a really big part of what we're going to play next is up to you guys. And Raymond did his whole little vote thing, and we really want to do something like that, too. Uh, and and just, you know, you know we, we did that. That's You guys picked Left 4 Dead for us, and um, we, we kind of want to play Borderlands. I really like Borderlands. My mic is right here. I don't know if you can actually see that or not. Oh, but, okay, so... You know, Zach always goes into this deep, emotional, like, he's talking about something that's really impacting on the community and everything like that. And I want to try to talk about that, something like that, too. Um, 
Mine's going to be a little bit different than from Zach's last week. His was about not doing shout outs and all that kind of stuff and bringing the community together. I'm going to talk about kind of what's destroying the community right now. And before you guys uh, jump on it, so this this is the, the title of discussion. It's Reddit destroying the community, right? I'm a huge Redditor. Don't get me wrong. I love Reddit. I am on there every single day. I'm reading posts and everything like that. But just like everyone else on there, I'm kind of helping slowly destroy the communities out there for games. Now, I'm going to be using League of Legends as a a specific example for this because that's kind of the best thing I know. It's the thing that I use the most and know the most. And a couple weeks ago, there was a post on Reign of Gaming, I believe, Um, It could be another thing, so I'm sorry if I misquoted that. Uh, But it kind of detailed on how Reddit is slowly destroying the League of Legends community and and, and not really allowing it to envelop and create itself. And now Reddit is really good, but it can also be bad, and I'm going to explain that. Um, Reddit is good because if you do something really cool, really amazing, you can post it on Reddit and it'll come up and everyone's like, awesome, cool, let's click on that. Um... But at the same time, for League of Legends, for example, that user base is a couple million strong, yet the Reddit user base is only 100,000. Um, and yet, every time something goes on to Reddit, the League of Legends Reddit, it blows up. It does really well, um, especially if it makes it onto the front page. Now, what this post kind of detailed is that for those things that don't make it consistently onto the front page, they end up failing. Um... And, and, and I see that as a problem, and, and I see that problem. That's It's not just Reddit that's doing that. I'm picking on Reddit here, but I don't really mean to. I love Reddit and everything, but I, I am, I'm doing the same thing that everyone else, is, uh, everyone else does. They go to the front page, they're like, I'm going to click on every link here on the front page and never go back to that channel ever again. And that's, that's where the problem lies, is let's say you create something on a weekly or daily basis that is really cool, but... Only, like, for your your second post, like, in the second week, your video gets to the top of Reddit on League of Legends. And it skyrockets and does a ton of views. But the problem is, the people who watch that video, even though it's the same quality content week after week, they don't watch the other videos. They only watch that one. So, like, that's cool, awesome. We don't care about the rest of your stuff. I just want to see this. And that's that's a problem. What I'm trying to say is you guys need to support your community. Support the people you really love. Color a Ninja is a really good example for me. I saw him off of Reddit. This, this is something that Reddit did good. It's awesome. It brought me to his channel. He does League of Legends, like, kind of comedy uh, shoutcasting-ish things where he plays a game and just tells them... Basically, tells you what's on his mind with all his friends and everything. It's really funny. I loved him. Um, but... Those videos did great. Um, specifically his I'll Make a Man Out of You and Zinzao video. I loved so much. Um, and all of his other League of Legends I loved a lot. But what I noticed is that he also does Let's Plays for things. Older games like Zelda, Ocarina of Time, that kind of stuff. And they don't do really well. They only d- get like maybe 2,000 views at the most. And whereas his League of Legends videos are getting like 500,000 plus views. Um, and what that is is the community goes on Reddit. They see that, oh... He's posted a new video they see on Reddit, and then they click on that. But then they never go back to the channel to see. And that's what you guys need to do. Go back to that channel. Go see. See what he's up to. Look at some of his Let's Plays. I really like his Let's Plays, um, aside from just the League of Legends ones. And, you know, I, I try to support that as much as possible. And and a lot of you are like, how do we support you guys? I don't. I, what do you want me to do? I don't want you guys to do anything. I, I, I want you to find content that you guys love and just continue to support that content and that's you know as somebody that makes videos and that does this kind of stuff we don't always know that that's what you guys want to see what what do you guys want to see we don't know unless you tell us uh if you like the video view the video uh comment on the video tell us go to our fan pages and just say oh my god you are awesome or maybe if you really hate someone like me just go to my channel oh you suck i hate you go die uh please don't do that that makes me cry i cry a lot at night no i don't actually but um support support the community um this is really really important for smaller channels Uh, You see a lot of smaller channels where you go there and it's like you look at the long list of videos they have and they have one video there that has a lot of views and the rest of them don't have any. And they're all, it's all really good content, 
But that one video is the only thing that's getting any love because that's the only video that made it onto Tumblr, that made it onto Reddit, that uh, was posted on, you know, some really big guy's fa Facebook or anything like that. And this is, this is kind of helping how you guys can help people succeed and help people outside that don't, don't already have a large view base, that don't have a large audience, um, you know, gain some traction. That, that little dip into Reddit does them great. But continue to follow them. If you see something that you really like on a Reddit or a Stumble or whatever have you, if you see something you like, you know, bookmark that. Go back to that channel every once in a while and be like, hey, I'm going to look at some of your other content. Maybe, maybe it's not good content. Maybe it really was only that one video. But give them a chance. Maybe subscribe. If, if you really like them, subscribing to them is the best way to show them that you love them. So do that. And I think, you know, as a whole, it'll make the community better. And I know, speaking from someone that is in that experience, that has had a couple of videos that do well, but don't, you know, not all the videos do well. You know, it, it would help to have the subscribers. It would help if you subscribe. help if you like and comment on the videos to tell us that you really like them. Uh, because it's you guys that can propel it. It's the audience. It's, it's me, you, everyone that helps propel this world. And it's something that uh this world by world i mean the youtube community is really the thing i'm experiencing but it happens all over the place uh websites and channels and everything like that so uh you guys help support your community like favorite and all that kind of stuff on videos that you love and uh and give them a chance watch their other videos as well so you guys that's really all i have to say to gay today to take to gay oh lordy <laughs> that's my new phrase uh oh lordy but yeah, so that's all I have, guys. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Look forward to the next MC Direct. Remember to check out all of our directors' channels. Um, Zach, me, Raymond, Blake, uh, Tom. Check all of them out. Stay tuned for more of this. And uh, we'll catch you guys on the flip side.